Every piece of furniture tells a story for this artist. Nicole Crowder upholsters pieces using traditional techniques, even though most furniture nowadays is mass-produced in factories. I think a lot about preservation. How do you take care of something? And I don't have children, so I think my furniture has become my children. It's something that I really have to take my time nurturing from start to finish. When a client sends her a piece of furniture to refurbish, Nicole's first step is usually fabric. I do a long deep dive into sourcing for fabrics. That is my favorite part of upholstery. And I start to you know, strip the piece, I take apart the layers. Um, if it's a chair, I usually start from the outside back and I will take the back off because it's almost like a mannequin. If you think about a mannequin in the store, the clothing has all been pinned back so that you have this tight silhouette, and that's what a chair is, essentially. This was the original upholstery. This was never taken off. Nicole wasn't always an upholsterer. She actually started her career as a photo editor, and though she loved her job, she eventually decided to take on her hobby full-time. Fully self-taught, um, YouTube University, I like to tell people, that's, I was on YouTube all the time. And that trial and error, very hands-on, just learning as I go, making a lot of mistakes as I go. And it just became this labor of love. There was so much to learn about it, about how to cut fabric, how to use the different tools that were involved. It just activated a different part of my brain that I really needed at that time. Nicole started in her small DC apartment four years ago, but eventually had to move to bigger and bigger spaces. Despite the pandemic, her orders have grown. Now she hires seamstresses and a driver and has contracts with hotels and restaurants around the city. Within six months, just the amount of work that I was being offered was, had increased exponentially. I think largely because folks were becoming more familiar with what I was doing and there's just so few upholsterers directly in D.C. Um, and also, you know, you have your own stamp on the work. There's this very specific kind of style and aesthetic that I have that I think people were interested in. Nicole charges anywhere from $900 to $2,200 and has worked on 60 pieces of furniture so far this year. One thing that I've really enjoyed about the way that I have scaled is very intentional about it. I, I take the time to really ask myself certain questions about, is this something I'm meant to do? Is this the way that I want to grow? Does this feel good? Do I have the bandwidth to take it on? And now I'm creating new products, doing meditation pillows. I am in the midst of designing my own custom furniture for the first time, which I'm incredibly excited about, and that just feels like a dream. That's how it's done. That's how it's done.